We are going on a safari. Not any kind of safari. Not we one with lions, elephants, buffaloes, cheetahs, leopards, none of that! None of that big five bullshit. <laughs> We're going on a moose safari, baby. The moose are loose in this hoose. There may be a goose. Oh, Jeremy, stop being so obtuse. Oh, come on, I'm just doing some Dr. Seuss. God, I might kill myself. <laughs> pass, me, pass me a noose. <laughs> but first we had to track them down. Despite being David Attenborough super fans, it was clear that we hadn't mastered the art of identifying animals in the wild. Is that a moose? It looks like a moose. Picture it looks like a moose. Picture of a moose. Ah, oh, it's just a bloody tree again. Okay. Is that one? That could very that much could be, be a moose. It's still got a massive nose too. It was so quiet that Tom might have started to become a little too obsessed with rhyming the word moose. There's a moose in the spruce. I'll probably call him Zeus. He's, I'll give him a bit of a Give a bit of abuse. <laughs> Don't look at my rhymes. Don't look at my rhymes. Let's stop with the rhymes. <laughs> I can't. No one likes them. Dr. Seuss went out of fashion a long time ago. But eventually, lurching out of the dense woodland, we finally got to meet Sweden's iconic king of the forest. And frankly, it was way too similar to a scene from Jurassic Park for Tom's liking. Ah! 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 Oh ah! God! <laughs> oh God! Oh, he's just dribbling. He's dribbling over the bends. Looking the windscreen. Work. Back off! <laughs> Back off! Uh, he's dribbling on the car, man. What do we do? Oh, thank God, he's lost interest. <laughs> Now it was Jeremy's turn to confront this absolute beast of a moose. Oh, Jeremy, he's coming round for you. He smelled that you were the weaker of the two. He smelled you meant your... to look them in the eye, you meant not meant to. Like, what, what, what do you do with this? You... However, Jeremy's attempt at negging the moose about the size of his nose did not go down too well. Look at that schnoz. That's such a huge schnoz. I, like, I mean, it's great. Don't, don't be embarrassed by it. I think it's a great schnoz. It's just, it's just remarkable how big it is. You can have an attractive good... No, man, you can have an attractive big nose. Oh. Dude. For God's sake. Oof. God damn it, Jeremy. You've, you've scared him off. You insulted his big old schnoz, and now he's hurt. This was a bit rich coming from Jez. I mean, looking at the size of a moose head, I could only draw one conclusion. Your oh, moose is a spirit yeah. animal. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Should never have mentioned how big their head was, mate. Who's want to talk? I would never have drawn the correlation there, but old moose boy Jeremy over here <laughs> with his fat head. Hey, we're one and the same. I know what you're going through, pal. That's your Patronus. Right there. Nice. That's a good one. <laughs> yeah. I actually find them fairly imposing and it's kind of terrifying. <laughs> yeah. They're huge. Sure, apparently if you feed moose. It's meese? Mice? <laughs> Mouse? My? Mine? <laughs> if you feed wild moose and you don't fucking <laughs> go. Don't mention feed. If you don't feed them next time you see them, they get really annoyed and like irate and they go. What the hell you didn't feed me for? When you feed me, where's my food? And then they come at you. I think this guy's like, lad, you got about five seconds to give me some food or you can 0121 do one and I'm ramming your ass. Well, that was Tom's audition for the Discovery Channel out the window until he got this killer shot. Oh, what a, what a, what a specimen. It's quite a handsome moose, that one. As mooses go, as moose go, it's pretty handsome. I'm having a real tough time with the plurals. Like, oh, yeah, should we ask? Excuse me. Oh, you... God, I didn't even see that one. <laughs> we could leave or we could go one, one more time. time. Let's Woo! keep this party going. If you enjoyed watching this, click the link below to subscribe to our channel to see more of our antics around the world. And if you hate the channel and don't want to subscribe, well, follow Jez and Tom on Instagram and tell us what exactly it is about Jeremy that you don't like. Oh, come on.